several met needs, unfortunately, but uh, I must say that the, the biggest one is to uh, have the specific biomarkers uh, in order to better phenotype uh, uh, allergic, allergic patients. I must say, uh, more specifically, more severe patients, uh, such as a severe asthmatics, a severe uh, patients with urticaria or atopic dermatitis, uh, because these patients uh, are those who deserve uh, to be treated by biologic agents uh, and uh, each biologic agent uh, need to be uh, well defined according to the phenotype and the endotype of, uh, of the disease. So uh, finding the right biomarker for each patient uh, would help the patient uh, to, and, and the physician to find uh, the correct treatment for them. The major challenge, uh, as far as, for example, asthma, is that now uh, we know some phenotypes of, uh, of uh, severe asthma. Uh, probably there are some other phenotypes that are still unknown or still not well defined. And uh, when we have, uh, we look at the, the, the therapeutical opportunities uh, uh, in biological terms, uh, we have uh, few biological biologicals most of them working uh, uh, on similar mechanism uh, or and in similar clinical phenotypes. So the major challenge is to try uh, is try to, really to define the sub phenotype for each patient in order to really choose the the right biological or the other one, even if the, they seem to work in a similar way in a similar uh, uh, under the similar biological mechanism. MicroRNAs uh, uh, are novel biomarkers. Uh, the, the studies about microRNAs started a few years ago, and uh, in asthma is still uh, is still really a, a niche uh, part of the research. And uh, I must say that microRNAs should be could be probably uh, a great uh, source of novel biomarkers uh, because uh, they really goes uh, into the deep mechanism uh, and uh, and in the the, the 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 deepest part of the of the, of the mechanism of each uh, part of the inflammation in uh, in asthma. So uh, we probably can use microRNAs uh, as novel biomarkers and not only uh, look in biomarkers uh, in uh, proteins uh, or uh, in uh, excelled breath uh, uh, methods and so on.